University of North Carolina at Chapel Hill is the first public university in the United States, and so of course we take that with a great sense of pride. There's a sense in which students who arrive here appreciate that they have a special opportunity. The partnership between UNC and Adobe Creative Cloud has provided licenses for every single student. It's only natural that you would want to take the most powerful collection of digital literacy tools and, and make them accessible to your students because this is how knowledge is made. The students find it extremely engaging to use Adobe Creative Cloud to get their work done in any class anywhere across the curriculum. So nursing, business, public health, even physics, chemistry, religious studies, and anthropology are using these tools not to learn how they work, but to help support teaching and learning. Everyone having access to this also means that you can learn from one another, which I think is going to be the best training tool and adoption tool as this continues to grow in the next couple of years. The engagement when students are working on digital projects goes way up. And I think that's linked to internal motivation as opposed to being motivated for a grade. What was really great about watching my students do this video poetry assignment was the students started to better understand their poems. It can happen in traditional ways, but the technology kind of makes really unexpected things jump out. I define digital literacy as critical digital literacy, which means it's not just the ability to use digital and information tools, it's the ability to think critically and to get critical work done with them. If I can use digital tools to move students to be active producers of knowledge rather than passive consumers, then I think it's really valuable. Students are really excited by the opportunity to really engage their work and not just produce work that's kind of end up on a shelf and no one else is going to see. These are communication tools and they inherently want students to take their deeply intellectual work and circulate it. At the end of every application right now, there's a share button and that's not accidental, that's powerful. This has truly been a partnership. We have seen investments on both sides of the equation. I'm pleased because Adobe certainly has invested in the University of North Carolina. Here in Chapel Hill, we're happy that Adobe can help us better provide these capabilities to our faculty and students, which they've done. All of these sorts of problem-solving approaches are really what's going to make you a valuable employee as you move forward. It's going to tell a story about who they are as a person, what they're doing, and what they want to do that will set them apart from other students in the same industry that are at universities that don't have access to this. There's clearly no limit to this. My students see that and their eyes light up.